www.harris-realty.net. Harris Real Estate is owned and operated by Mark Williams. Call us today for all your real estate needs. Local news on WIFO. It's time now for a little instant local news. In the news, the weather, a big story is tonight's graduation ceremony depends on the window of no rain in order to get the ceremony in this evening at J.C. Stadium. Ceremony set for 7.30 p.m. Approximately 320 seniors set to walk across stage, receive their hard-earned high school diploma from Wayne County High School. High School Principal Bo Adams says every effort will be made to get the ceremony in this evening. There is a backup plan for Saturday at 10 a.m. They can't get in this evening. It will be a wait-and-see day. Everyone hoping that the ceremony can be held this evening. Last night, a lot of bad weather in the area. Emergency Management Director Donnie Ray confirming a tornado touching down around 6.50 in the afternoon, Thursday afternoon at Miller Road and Roy Wright Road in Scriven, Georgia. Fortunately, no one was injured, only minor damage to a couple of houses and sheds in the area came up quickly. Donnie Ray says they received no indication from the National Weather Service about the storm approaching the area. Again, the weekend forecast, especially for Sunday and Monday, calling for a lot of rain. Many Memorial Day outdoor activities are going to be in jeopardy with the forecast from the National Weather Service which calls for heavy rain both Sunday and Monday. Once again, the graduation ceremony is set for this evening, time 7.30. They ask that all guests be in their seats by 7.20. This graduation ceremony will begin right at 7.30 p.m. Both the valedictorian and salutatorian scheduled to speak. This year's valedictorian, Christina Thomas. This year's salutatorian, Andrew McGraw. And Christina Thomas also recognized the board meeting as a Georgia Scholar recipient. Again, the graduation ceremony set for this evening. Last night it was honors night, and we'll come back and take a look at that report right after this word from our sponsor, other commercial messages, so please stay tuned. The Trademark at 3689 Savannah Highway has been serving Wayne County and surrounding counties for over 30 years. If it's a small hand tool you're looking for or a 30-ton bearing press, we've got it. You need a tarp? We've got you covered. We have any size you need, from a 5x7 to a 30x60. So if you need a quality tool at an affordable price, come see us at the Trademark, 3689 Savannah Highway, or call us at 427-6966. That's 427-6966. The Trademark. The tool supply place. Dude. Some of those pushy city boy car guys have copped an attitude. Hey, the attitude at Woody Folsom Overflow Center in Jessup is do business. You said it. This is Woody inviting you in for sales and service. We always give you more car for your money and more money for your car. Say bye-bye to pushy car guy and howdy to cousin Woody. This is Lim Tooten, Woody's Jessup General Manager, inviting all my friends from Pierce, Ware, Charlton, Bacon, and Brantley Counties to come see us in Jessup. Ask about that free lifetime Powertrain warranty. Hey, we're trucking. Every car, truck, and SUV has undergone a rigorous inspection and is road ready and priced to move, baby, move. Well, speaking of moving, I just love my new neighbor Florence from New Jersey. She's got this plaque that says, I ain't from the South, but I got here as quick as I could. <laughs> Woody Folsom Overflow, North First in Jessup. Get here as quick as you can. Tell it, girl. Some restrictions apply. See dealer for details. Check out these special offers from Harris Ace Hardware. Get a Stanley Power Lock tape measure and save $7 off the regular price. It's now only $4.99 with Ace Rewards card. Buy a Traeger Grill for $3.99.99 or more, and Harris Ace will assemble and deliver it free for Ace Reward card members. Plus, an Ace Lawn and Garden 2-gallon sprayer is only $9.99. Help for service and the best prices. Harris Ace Hardware, West Cherry Street in Jessup. Honors night held Thursday at the high school auditorium, 156 scholarships handed out, totaling $719,000. Here's a rundown of the recipients. We're going to do the athletic scholarships in local sports. In the valedictorian, Christina Thomas, salutatorian, Andrew McGraw, star student, Christina Thomas, Governor's Honors Program recipient, Carlton McKenzie Oliver. Perfect attendance for four years, Zamir Hayes, Billy Parker, and Genesis Rambert. They all received $200. American Red Cross, $500 scholarship went to Ashley Needham. Clay Tire Memorial, $500 scholarship went to Joshua Todd King. Minority Student Achievement, $1,000 scholarship went to Zamir Hayes. Trey Harris Leadership, $1,000 went to Leslie Mansfield. United Steel's Workers, $787. Two $1,000 scholarships went to William Duncan and Mark Murphy. FFA, $500 scholarship went to Jacob Clary. Coastal Pines Technical College, $500 went to Brianna Batten. Chesapeake VFW Post, $4583. dollars $1,000 scholarship went to Jasmine Jordan. Ray Hames Tennis Scholarships, two hundred fifty went to Kelly Popple and Lisette Lactal. Wayne County Farm Bureau, five hundred dollars scholarship went to Jacob Clary and Sam Fountain. 
Jack of Zone, three $500 scholarships went to Aaron Long, Alyssa Smith, and Hannah Williamson. L.A. Sunny Bowen Jr. Endowment, 2000 scholarship went to Jerry Milligan. Thelma B. Heath Memorial, $500 scholarship went to Becca Bennett. WBL, $500 went to Alyssa Smith. Alma Telephone, $500 went to Jasmine Jordan. Wayne County Garden Club, two $1,000 scholarships went to Sam Fine and Andrew Headley. Wayne County Retired Educators, $1,000 scholarship went to Sydney Lantrip. Alto Wildlife Association, four $500 scholarships went to Jacob Clary, Andrew Headley, Carson Popple, and Shelby Cerency. Altima Federal Credit Union, two $1,500 scholarships went to Trenton Jackson and Sydney Lantrip. Alpha Delta Kappa, $250 scholarship went to Mary Grace Manning. Andy Voles Memorial, four $500 scholarships went to Cody Bennett, Jab- Jameson Drotty, Samantha Mendez, and Andrea Mendez Rosa. The AARP, $500 scholarship went to Genesis Rembert. Wayne County Young Farmers, $1,000 scholarship went to Jacob Clary. The Aline Kendrick, $500 scholarship went to Naziah Bugs, And also Carlton McKenzie Oliver. Business and Professional Women's, three $1,500 scholarships went to Gracie Fry, Mary Grace Manning, and Carson Popple. Exchange Clubs, two $1,000 scholarships went to Peyton Parker and Grace Dixon. Mary Ellen McKenzie, two $500 scholarships went to Amber Barwick and Genesis Rembert. A SCAD $54,000 scholarship went to Gloria Blaylock. Georgia DOT Employees Association, $650 scholarship went to David Scott. Compton Scholar, $1,500 went to Willie Vaughn. The George M. Weinstein Scholarships, $1,900 went to Willie Vaughn. And the $2,000 scholarship went to Miranda Wayne Scott. Foundation Scholarship, $800 went to Miranda Wayne Scott. The Ron Birch, two $1,000 scholarships went to Jacob Cleary and Sam Fountain. Mercer University Scholarship of $94,000 went to Peyton Parker. Also at Mercer University, a $68,000 scholarship went to Mia Spinola. The Jensen Glam, $500 scholarship went to Zamir Hayes. Piedmont College, $52,000 scholarship went to Bradley Manning. Wayne County, $500 scholarships went to Andrew McGraw and Christina Thomas. Free Enterprise, $1,000 scholarship went to Lily Peekler. Harris Service Scholarship, two $1,000 scholarships went to Amber Barwick and Shelby Campbell. Chester Bar Association, $1,000 scholarship went to Miranda Wainscott. Gerald Jones Memorial 4-H Scholarship went to Preston Lee Barrow. The Martha Puckett Middle School $500 Scholarship went to Zion Dancer. Annie B. Given Scholarship $1,000 went to Christina Thomas. Near State Credit Union $1,000 Scholarships went to Clayton Hardenbrook and Jerry Milligan. And also Carlton McKenzie Oliver. Okie Finoki, two $2,000 Scholarships went to Becca Bennett and Alyssa Smith. The Jamie Denny Journalism Scholarship, $500, went to Emily Manning. Wayne County Pep Club, two $500 scholarships went to Peyton Parker and Alyssa Smith. Jessup Rotary Club, $2,500 scholarship went to Andrew McGraw. Arthur Williams Middle School, $500 scholarship went to Sam Fountain. The Jimmy Sullivan Award went to Jonathan Garrett Overholt, $1,000 scholarship. Else Club Scholarships, $1,000 to Gracie Fry, $500 to Lily Pigler, and $500 to Adley Branch. Piranha Scholarship, two $500 scholarships went to Clayton Hardenbrook and Christina Thomas. The Epworth United Methodist $500 scholarship went to Kuzlita Moore. The Satilla REMC, four $1,000 scholarships went to Adley Branch, Aaron Long, Alyssa Smith, and Christina Thomas. The Dr. A.N. Tillery $500 scholarship went to Alyssa Smith. Georgia Military College at $26,367 went to Zachary Lane. United States Senate Youth Program $500 scholarship went to went to Lily Pigler. Golf Association's $1,500 scholarship went to Dalton Davidson. Rick Popple Entrepreneur Scholarship, $1,000 went to Samantha Mendez. Kiwanis Clubs, $2,500 scholarships went to Andrew McGraw and Kuzlita Moore. The Kiwanis Club Colonel John Parker, $1,500 scholarship went to Christina Thomas. The Kiwanis Club, $500 scholarship went to Brianna Batten. Boys and Girls Club, $1,000 scholarship went to Gloria Blaylock. Odom Homecoming, Two $500 scholarships went to Leslie Manfield and Connor Stevens. The NAACP $1,000 scholarship went to Zion Dancer. Flatwoods Gobblers Chapter $500 scholarship went to Aaron Nicole Long. Also, Flatwoods Gobblers Chapter $1,000 scholarship went to Alyssa Smith. The Scriven PTO $500 scholarship went to Hannah Williamson. The Willene Todd Memorial $1,000 scholarship went to Connor Stevens. And the Sons of American Revolution gave out 14 $1,075 scholarships. 
The recipients, Adley Branch, Dalton Davison, James Andrade, Jasmine Jordan, Aaron Long, Jerry Milligan, Carlton McKenzie Oliver, William Hampton Parker, Bryson Larry Priester, Alyssa Elena Smith, Caleb Smith, Shelby Cerency, Mary Tillman, and Reagan Weaver. The Barber struck off six $200 scholarships went to Ashley Burkhalter, Haley Dennison, Gracie Fry, Mary Grace Manning, and Shelby Grace Cerency, and Mary Tillman. Wayne County Band Boosters gave out 10 $100 scholarships. Sydney Allen, Rebecca Fox, Mackenzie Marie Landon, Leslie Ann Mansfield, Andrew James McGraw, Eden Morris, Samuel Nettles, Ethan Pye, Brooke Elizabeth Stevens, Reagan Weaver. The Coca-Cola Four Scholarships went to Grace Evelyn Dixon, William Parker, Alyssa Smith, and Christina Thomas. And we'll do the athletic scholarships in local sports. We'll come back with some final news notes after this word from our sponsor of the commercial messages. So please stay tuned. The Trademark at 3689 Savannah Highway has been serving Wayne County and surrounding counties for over 30 years. If it's a small hand tool you're looking for or a 30-ton bearing press, we've got it. You need a tarp? We've got you covered. We have any size you need, from a 5x7 to a 30x60. So if you need a quality tool at an affordable price, come see us at the Trademark, 3689 Savannah Highway, or call us at 427-6966. That's 427-6966. The Trademark, the tool supply place. Morton Collision is located at 1320 West Pine Street in Jessup. Morton's offers free estimates, 23-hour towing, and they guarantee their work. Call 427-3769 or after hours, 912-294-6140. The staff at Morton Collision Center works with all insurance companies. So for guaranteed work with a qualified staff, go to Morton Collision at 1320 West Pine Street in Jessup. Morton Collision, quality you can see. When further treatment is no longer an option, hospice can provide services to manage symptoms and difficulties caused by illness. Emotional, psychosocial, and spiritual care, as well as support to the families and caregivers, are all part of hospice care. Hospice of South Georgia has been a part of the health community in Wayne and surrounding counties since 1998. The professional yet compassionate attention provided by our staff is unsurpassed. Widely supported by donations from the local population, Hospice of South Georgia is the local nonprofit hospice in Wayne County. Our administrative office is located at 1625 Sunset Boulevard, and Hospice of South Georgia accepts anyone who meets hospice criteria, regardless of their ability to pay. Please call 912-588-0080 to speak with someone about hospice care. That was 912-588-0080. We are your hometown hospice, and we are here to serve you. Hospice of South Georgia working to add life to your days. Final notes and news. Wayne County Catfish Tournament set for the weekend of June 2nd and 3rd on the Ultima River. Tournament begins at noon on Saturday, continues until Sunday at 2 p.m. that weekend. This year's event offers the fishermen opportunity to earn a $7,500 first place prize with payouts for other places determined on the number of entries into the event. Way in and tournament headquarters will be again at J.C. Fairgrounds at J.C. Landing. Those fishing the event can put in anywhere on the Ultima River, but they must be in line at weigh-in at 2 p.m. on Sunday. Tournament officials ask those entering the event to come by the fairgrounds to receive their T-shirts. Entry fee into the catfish tournament is $100 per fisherman. Registration can be done online at www.active.com or can be dropped off at the Tourism Board's office at the Jessup Train Depot. Registration packets available online or at the Train Depot. If you need more information, call the Tourism Board office at 427-3233 or check out the event website at waynetourism.com. Once again, the big story, can graduation be held tonight? Hopefully it will. Weather forecast is going to be dependent on that. And you can check out the high school's website all day long and keep it tuned here to Big Dog Country at 105.5. We'll keep you posted. But the ceremony is set for tonight at 730, and they just need a window of opportunity to get in. They're going to make every effort to get in tonight. Again, if it can't get in tonight, the backup plan is Saturday at 10 a.m. at the stadium. That's going to do it for latest in local news. Sports comes your way in a few minutes. Bob Morgan, Center for Great Day. You've been listening to local news on WIFO. 
Do you need a new lawnmower? If so, head to Night Saw Company in Baxley. Choose from a large selection of name brand mowers. Night Saw Company offers the best lawnmowers at the best prices anywhere. They also have in stock belts, batteries, and parts for all mowers, along with name brand trimmers, blowers, and hedge trimmers. For over 50 years, Wayne Countyans have been getting their power lawn equipment and parts from Knights. Night Saw Company on the Jessup side of Baxley on Highway 341. May is Melanoma and Skin Cancer Awareness Month. Georgia Dermatology invites you to their Jessup office, conveniently located at 980 South 1st Street, directly across from Sonic. Dr. Michael Sharkey and physician assistants Heather Neesmith and Lindsay Bookhart are now accepting new and established patients Monday through Friday to take care of all your skin needs, including skin cancer treatments, acne, rashes, and much more. Call today at 427-4267 to set up your appointment with Georgia's premier dermatology and skin cancer specialist with locations in Jessup and Waycross. For more information, Visit us online at gadurham.com. We are having a great day at CHSGA Home Health. We know there's no place like home when recovering from an illness or surgery. CHSGA Home Health provides the compassionate care and services you or a loved one is in need of. Our services include skilled nursing, physical, occupational, speech therapy, and IV medication therapy. CHSGA Home Health has multiple disease management programs designed to meet your individual needs. Give us a call to hear more about how we can help you to have a great day as you recover in the comforts of your home. 912-916-9195. That's CHSGA. Home Health. Good morning, everyone. Our Friday forecast is going to be partly sunny. Through the afternoon, we bring in a 30% chance of showers and storms. Highs will be in the mid-80s. Some of the rain tapers off tonight. Our Saturday forecast, almost an identical day, partly sunny, 30% chance of showers or storms. Highs will be low to mid-80s. A much better chance of showers and storms Sunday and Monday. Highs near 80 degrees. I'm Georgia meteorologist Laura Huckabee in the GNN Weather Center. At Country Financial, we're more than just an office you may pass by as you drive through town. We're a part of your community and help support the programs that make our neighborhood thrive. We take the time to get to know our customers. We know that every situation is unique and our goal is to understand yours. So we can help you be confident about your financial security and your future. Call me, Sean O'Quinn, your local Country Financial representative today to talk about how we can help ensure that the future you're dreaming of is something you can proudly own no matter what it looks like. My number is 588 1051. Pending final grades, the names announced may not necessarily be eligible to graduate. Congratulations to the Wayne County High School graduating class of 2018. The following businesses, individuals, and organizations salute you and wish you best luck in the future. Will Hurst Allstate salutes Andrew Jacob West, Shadavia Jabrene Alexia West, Cassidy Faith Wheelis. Victoria Lee Whitney, Mason Darrell Wiggins, Ariana Nicole Williams, Macarius Tyrell Williams, Carly Ariana Williamson, Hunter Jacob Bora Sophia Woodson, Madison Grace Yeomans, Joseph Luis Yornet Jr., Justine Rose Zuck. Unity Church of God salutes Haley Dennison, Marissa Grace Moody, Cheyenne Reese, Cassidy Faith Wheelis, and Kaylee Christine Wood. WIFOFM is Big Dog Country at 733 on this Friday morning. It's time to check your birthdays and anniversaries. Brought to you today by Bargeman Power Sports. Happy birthday wishes today to Jordan Lee Heron. Happy birthday, Jordan, from a proud Nana Francis. Hope you have a good day today for Jordan Lee Heron. Jordan Lee Heron from Nana Francis. Happy birthday. More wishes for Jordan Heron. Happy birthday, George Orr. We love you. Love Tay Tay, Ivory, and Kane for Jordan Heron. Jordan Heron. Happy birthday, Jordan Heron, today. Happy 6th birthday to Paisley Jackson. We love you so much. Love Mama, Daddy, and Alex. Paisley Jackson. Happy birthday to Paisley Jackson. Love Mama, Daddy, and Alex today. Sage Fender, 18. Happy 18th birthday, Sage. We love you from Gigi, Poppy, Sophie, and Dax. Sage Fender. Happy birthday to Sage Fender today. From Gigi, Poppy, Sophie, and Dax. Sage Fender, 18 today. Please wish Jordan Heron a happy birthday today with love from Daddy, Mama, and JoJo. Jordan Heron from Daddy, Mama, and JoJo today. Happy first birthday to Emma Kate Branch. Emma Kate Branch, one year old. 
You have truly blessed our life. We love you. That's from Mimi, KK, and Adley, Aunt Emily, and Granddaddy. Emma Kate Branch is one year old today. Happy sixth birthday wishes. More wishes for Paisley Jackson. Love Aunt Angie, Uncle Jamie, Clinton, and Riley. Paisley Jackson is six. On Saturday, happy birthday to Mary. That's all it says. Happy birthday to Mary. Mary, Mary, quite contrary. Anyway, Mary on Saturday, happy birthday to Mary. Robin Eubanks list today. Ann Manning celebrating. Happy birthday to Ann Manning. June Morris on the list as well. June Morris. Brooke Rania, Brooke Rania. Leeward Tarber, Leeward Tarber. Wanda Carter on the list as well. Wanda Carter. Deidre Byers, Deidre Byers celebrating. Hannah Thornton list on as, as well. Hannah Thornton. Alan Anderson, Alan Anderson celebrating. And Patricia Dunham rounding out Friday. Patricia Dunham. On Saturday, it's Mertice Dunn, Mertis Dunn, Jennifer Kirkland, Jennifer Kirkland, and Sierra Zuxwort. Sierra Zuxwort on Saturday. Sunday, Mark Watson celebrating. Birthday wishes Mark Watson. Melanie Sapp on the list. Melanie Sapp. James Chadwick. James Chadwick on the list. Gregory O'Brien celebrating as well. Gregory O'Brien. David Corbin celebrating. Happy birthday, David Corbin. And uh, Samuel Moody. Samuel Moody rounding out the uh, Robin Eubank State Farm list for the uh, weekend. Happy birthday today to Pat York, Pat York, and then Christine Paul. Christine Paul on Sunday from the Trapnell family for Pat York and Christine Paul over the weekend. Happy birthday from the Trapnell family. Long County calendar. Nobody on the 25th, nobody on the 26th, but happy anniversary, Archie and Sheila Popple on Sunday. Happy anniversary, Archie and Sheila, po- Sheila Popple on Sunday. Uh, Sunday. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? I got to do Memorial Day birthdays because we're not going to be here Monday. Kathy Hendricks on the Long County calendar. Kathy Hendricks on the Long County calendar for Monday, Memorial Day. Good thing I saw that. Robin Eubanks on Memorial Day. Bonnie Ellis, Bonnie Ellis, and Frida Woodcock celebrating. Bonnie Ellis, Frida Woodcock. Also wishes for Mary Ann Griffiths. Mary Ann Griffiths from the Trapmole family for Mary Ann Griffiths. Let's go back through the folder quickly and see if there's anybody else on the 28th. All right, don't see anything there. Here we go. Happy birthday to our nephew, Kevin Spell, celebrating on Monday with family and friends for Kevin Spell. Love you, Aunt Kathy, Uncle Jerry, and Madison wishing Kevin Spell birthday wishes on Monday. All right, that's in the future, that's in the future, that's in the future. That's way in the future. All right, so I think I've covered my bases there, crossed my I's, dotted my T's, done due diligence for Monday. If you have a Memorial Day birthday, you can text one in right now via text at 912 412- Four two seven three seven one one. Got to get Monday in there as well because we won't be here for the holiday. And we got a ton of texts. Let's move on. Happy birthday today to Daniel Gandy. Daniel Gandy, I'm proud to be your mom. Happy birthday today to Daniel Gandy. Happy birthday to Kensley from your papa. Kensley from your papa today. Happy birthday to granddaddy Tony Armstrong. Tony Armstrong from Caroline Trip and Kate for Tony Armstrong from Caroline Trip and Kate Happy. Birthday to Granddaddy Tony Armstrong from Caroline Tripp and Kate. Happy first birthday, Emma Kate Branch from Maggie, Ada, and Haley for Emma Kate Branch, one-year-old from Maggie, Ada, and Haley. Happy birthday, Juju. Love Harlan and Asher for Juju. Happy birthday, Juju from Harlan and Asher. Happy 18th birthday and happy graduation day to Sage Fender. Sage Fender, we love you and are so proud of you. From Mama, Daddy, and Sophie, happy 18th birthday, happy graduation day, Sage Fender. Happy birthday to Davina Bunch Daly. Davina Bunch Daly from your husband, your son Aiden, your dad, mom, granddad Bay, grandma Ida, sisters and brothers. Davina Bunch Daly. Happy birthday, Davina Bunch Daly. Happy birthday to Daniel Gandy. I'm proud to be your mom. More wishes for, uh, uh, I'm sorry, Donna Crane. Love Timothy, Emma, and Piper. Donna Crane. Love Timothy, Emma, and Piper. And more wishes for Donna Crane. Love R.B., Kristen, Hayden, Ezra, Adeline, and Kensington. Wishing Donna Crane happy birthday. Also from Rush, Ryan, Kyler, Ann, and Olivia. Wishing Donna Crane happy birthday. Also from Tammy and JoJo for Donna Crane. Will you put Ms. Mary's name on the radio? Her birthday's on Saturday, May 26th, but do it on Friday the 25th. Yeah, got to do that that way. Happy birthday, Ms. Mary from Chad. Or Ms. Mary from Chad today. Okay. Let's see here. (laughs) 
All right. Uh, happy birthday on Monday the 28th to Lucy Kicklighter from Bill and Barbara. Lucy Kicklighter from Bill and Barbara on Monday the 28th. And happy second birthday, Noah Kate Heron. Noah Kate Heron from Mama and Daddy. Noah Kate is two on Sunday. Noah Kate here in two on Sunday. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. You've got time to shoot one in via text at 912-427-3711. Happy anniversary to my wife, Carla Armstrong, on Saturday the 26th. Happy anniversary to my wife, Carla Armstrong, on Saturday the 26th. Birthdays and anniversaries on WIFOFM brought to you each and every weekday morning by Bargerin Power Sports. Famous birthdays today, comedian Mike Myers is 55. One million dollars. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, baby. <laughs> Singer songwriter Tom T. Hall is 82. I love little baby ducks, old pickup trucks, slow moving trains, and rain. And actor Claude Akins was born in 1926. Claude Akins for Super Polygrip. It's murder when food gets lodged between your dentures and gums. Ouch! Happy birthday to Sage Fender from the Perkins family. For Sage Fender from the Perkins family. And happy birthday to James Pye from the family. We love you. That's on Saturday for James Pye from the family with love. All right, last call for birthdays. you got 30 seconds to shoot within via text at 912-427-3711. We'll come back with your big dog country birthday cake winners. I guess we got to do three. Yeah. Today, the weekend, and Monday. We'll do that right after this for Bargeman Power Sports. Bargeman Power Sports invites everyone to come visit their unbelievable new showroom on Highway 301 South in Jessup and on Highway 341 in Brunswick. They have a great selection of ATVs, golf carts, mowers, and more. Bargeman Power Sports carries Arctic Cat four-wheelers and side-by-sides, the new popular Can-Am four-wheelers and side-by-sides, cruise carts, and Yamaha golf carts. Bargeman has the full line of Kimco scooters. Don't forget, Bargeman Power Sports offers a complete service department for all your service and repair needs. Stop by today and check out Bargeman Power Sports. Highway 301 South in Jessup and their new location on Highway 341 next to I-95 in Brunswick. Your Big Dog Country birthday cake winners on this Friday. We've got Noah Kate Heron, two. Paisley Jackson is six. And I guess we need a third one, don't we? We need a third one. Emma Kate Branch, who is one year old. They pick up the cakes from the Jessup Piggly Wiggly Bakery. Certificate here at the station. Come by, pick that up. Good for today. Only head to the pig and claim your prize. Bargeman Power Sports brings you the birthdays and anniversaries. Runs with Jessup online. BargemanPowerSports.com. Thank you for waking up with FM 105.5 WIFO FM, the big dog in Jessup. At 742 on this graduation Friday, going to try and get it in no matter what. There are contingency plans, uh, but thank you for waking up at WIFOFM Big Dog Country. Happy birthday. Emma Kate Branch, one, and Noah Kate Heron, two, and Paisley Jackson, six. They pick up the cakes from the Jessup Piggly Wiggly Bakery. All right, 743, let's get a look at that GNN Weather Center forecast. Good morning, everyone. Our Friday forecast is going to be partly sunny. Through the afternoon, we bring in a 30% chance of showers and storms. Highs will be in the mid-80s. Some of the rain tapers off tonight. Our Saturday forecast, almost an identical day, partly sunny, 30% chance of showers or storms. Highs will be low to mid-80s. A much better chance of showers and storms Sunday and Monday. Highs near 80 degrees. I'm Georgia meteorologist Laura Huckabee in the GNN Weather Center. River level is at 8 feet even rising, 8 feet and rising river level. We've got a Low tide, 1155. High this afternoon, 608, 7.2 feet. Sunset is at 825. Temperatures in the low to mid-70s, 71 here at the Big Dog WIFO. Thank you for waking up at 744 with FM 105.5. It's Friday! A graduation Friday. Weatherman permitting, got to get that window in. Hopefully we can do that tonight. We'll start at 730 from J.C. Stadium. The uh, gates will be locked uh, they want you in your seats by 7.15. The gates will be locked as the processional gets underway. And try and get that in tonight. Over 300 graduates for Wayne County High School as graduation is set for tonight. And we'll have it for you live here on WIFOFM with a replay uh, tomorrow at noon following America's uh, Greatest Hits with Scott Shannon. 7.44 here at FM 105.5. 
on this graduation Friday. Uh, no school, you can tell from the traffic. About uh, 90% less traffic in the mornings when school's not in session. Seasons change. Quality of service does it. For 75 years, First Franklin Financial has been serving the financial needs of your friends and neighbors. You can always depend on the caring staff to be there when you need them. Drop by and see your friendly Franklin folks at 1074 North Macon Street or give them a call at 427-4237 or apply online at 1FFC.com. All loans are subject to our liberal credit policy and limitations, if any. First Franklin Financial Corporation, NMLSR number 141654. Georgia Residential Mortgage License number 5656. When you have an accident, you, not the insurance company, chooses the body shop and you only need one estimate. All you have to do is call Jerome Riles at BNC Collision Center in downtown Scriven to deal with the adjusters and insurance company. Whether it's a little ding or a major crash, that BNC Collision Center across from Wazden Cabinet Shop in Scriven deal with the insurance company so you don't have to. Call them at 579-2274. That's 579-2274. For all your medical needs, Tim's Home Medical on South 1st Street in Jessup has you covered. Oxygen, CPAP equipment, wheelchairs, walkers, hospital beds, plus specialty medical equipment from a local company that cares. Tim's Home Medical can handle Medicare, Medicaid, and private insurance billing, as well as family records for tax purposes. Tim's Home Medical, owned and operated by Tim Sloan, 918 South 1st Street in Jessup. Tim's Home Medical. Call 385-2490, 385-2490. Insects can rob your trees, shrubs, lawns, and flowers of vital nutrients. Fertilone makes several products to help control pests effectively, and they're available at Wayne Feed and Seed in Jessup. The knowledgeable folks at Wayne Feed and Seed can help you select the correct Fertilone product to help you control insects. There are several to choose from, including tree and shrub systemic, insect drench, and fruit tree spray. Fertilone insecticides, fungicides, metacides, and other products are found at Wayne Feed and Seed, 712 West Cherry Street in Jessup. Wayne County High School Class of 2018 invites you to the graduation ceremony Friday night at J.C. Stadium. The ceremony begins at 7.30, so everyone is encouraged to be in their seats by 7.20. WIFO 105.5 FM will broadcast the graduation ceremony live Friday night and replay it Saturday at 12 noon. Our broadcast of Wayne County High School's graduation ceremony will be brought to you exclusively by Interstate Credit Union. Interstate Credit Union, West Cherry Street in Jessup. WIFOFM is Big Dog Country on this Friday morning, graduation Friday, 747, 13 minutes until late, also a jumbo jet. It is time for state news from GNN, brought to you by England's Mobile Glass and England's Collision Center. England's Collision Center and Mobile Glass. You know a good feeling is when you pick up your car satisfied. England's Collision Center and Mobile Glass, serving our community for over 20 years for all your collision and windshield needs. England's Collision Center, located at 586 Southwest Broad Street, 912-588-9922. From the Georgia 811 Call Before You Dig News Center, I'm Matt Cook with the Georgia News Network. Do you have your plan B in place yet? Now, everybody likes to make plans for the Memorial Day weekend, but we have seen a steamy and rainy week and a half so far, and apparently more is on the way in the form of a low-pressure system moving into the Gulf of Mexico. GNN meteorologist John Weatherby says it could turn into something. Environmental conditions are forecast to be much more conducive for development, and a subtropical or tropical depression or storm is likely to form during the weekend. We're thinking sometime late Saturday into Sunday. We could see tropical storm alberto before it's all over and they think it's going to rain all over us some parts of the state could get four or five inches of rain from the storm over the weekend and into next week meanwhile the state patrol says they're going to be out in force for the holiday weekend looking for duis and distracted drivers we'll have concentrated patrols on the high crash quarters we're going to have road checks early late afternoon evenings overnight we're going to be there State Patrol spokesman Captain Mark Perry. Today is a busy travel day, of course, on the roads and in the air. Hearts Hill Jackson Airport's filling up. A Gwinnett County woman has been charged with aggravated animal cruelty for allegedly leaving her dog in a hot car for about five hours. The dog died. They say 46-year-old Connie Gomez parked her car outside of the Gwinnett County Jail. She was visiting a courtroom inside at the time. 
A Jonesboro High School senior says he does not remember a car hitting him this week, but his injuries did not stop him from attending his graduation just the same. Michael Taylor was treated for a concussion and a number of other injuries as well just this past Monday after the car hit him. The driver reportedly stopped to make sure he was okay. Jonesboro's graduation ceremonies were held last night. Continuing news updates, I'm Matt Cook with the Georgia News Network. That's the sound of a new world of power and performance. Not light years away, but right around the corner at Steel Dealer Days. Right now, pick your power with the Steel FS38 fuel power trimmer at just $129.95 or specially priced FSA45 battery power trimmer at just $119.95. Find your power at steeldealers.com. Offer valid for a limited time at participating dealers while supplies last. See dealer for details. I'm Corporal James Metz with the Georgia State Patrol. I convinced a young couple to wear their seatbelts during a traffic stop. Later that same day, I got a call of a car that had rolled over. I just passed a vehicle turned upside down. It was a couple I just stopped. They weren't hurt and thanked me for getting them to wear their seatbelts. You sure no one's hurt, right? Oh, I'm positive. I sat here and talked for a minute. This is Harris Blackwood, director of the Governor's Office of Highway Safety. Georgia's seatbelt law saves lives, including yours. If you don't want to click it, expect to get a ticket. This message from the Governor's Office of Highway Safety. Pending final grades, the names announced may not necessarily be eligible to graduate. Congratulations to the Wayne County High School graduating class of 2018. The following businesses, individuals, and organizations salute you and wish you best luck in the future. Fellowship Baptist Church salutes Patricia Morgan, Bryson Priester, Corey Withrow, and Shelby Lynn Sands. Morton Collision Center salutes Brooke Reese and Cheyenne Reese. Jessup Broadcasting salutes Dalton Gage Daniels. Western Sislin salutes Emily Agniga, Samuel McCraney, Taylor Hoover, Shaheen Black, and Benton Ezekiel Oliver. First Franklin Financial salutes Tyrissa Carter, Trenton Jackson, and Preston Barrow. Employee pricing means buy here like you work here. Yeah, the chop prices are widespread at Woody Folsom Automotive. Better get to Baxley where we've chopped 18 Chevy Silverado 1500s by up to $11,000. I like it. We got regular caps, double caps, crew caps, every kind of cap but a taxi cap. Two wheel, four wheel, gas or diesel, Chevrolet and GMC. We got the trucks. And prices? Lord of mercy. We'll do them like Mama used to do taters. We'll cook up a mess. Mash them flat as a pancake and put some gravy on them. You'll love that gravy. Woody's right. You cannot lose with the gravy we use. Nail down 0% for 60 months on 18 Buick Regal. Nearly every new and used vehicle we sell comes with a free lifetime powertrain warranty. Find new roads. Click WoodyFolsom.com or come straight to Woody Folsom Automotive, 341 West in Baxley. You'll love that gravy. That bears repeating. You'll love that gravy. Some restrictions apply. See dealer for details. Hotcha. Corrections and retractions. And somebody asked to uh, wish Ms. Mary another happy birthday wish for Ms. Mary today. Uh, her birthday is on Saturday, May 26th, but we're going to wish her happy birthday today. Happy birthday, Ms. Mary, from Chad. Corrections and retractions. 7.53, time for the Family Minute with Mark Merrill on WIFO FM, brought to you by Wayne Obstetrics and Gynecology. Dr. Harris and the staff of Wayne Obstetrics and Gynecology want to wish the Wayne County Yellow Jackets the best this season. Dr. Jeffrey Harris offers comprehensive care for women in Jessup, Wayne County, and the neighboring areas. He is board certified in obstetrics, gynecology, and family practice. Dr. Harris offers health care to women in any stage of life. Call them at 530-7301. That's 530-7301. Go Jackets. Want to be a better spouse? I'm Mark Merrill with today's Family Minute. It's easy to instruct your mate on how they can be a better husband or wife. But maybe it's time to look at yourself. Maybe it's time for you to be the best you can be. How? First, accept your spouse for who they are. Love them unconditionally. Accept their wonderful qualities and their flaws. Second, applaud your spouse. When you see your spouse doing something good, encourage them with your words. 
Third, allow them to be who God created them to be. Instead of wanting them to be more like you, give them the freedom to be themselves. My wife Susan and I recently sat down and talked about how we can be.